welcome in my channel windows form so let's to start the part 3 of banking system so first of all design a menu form for uh, MDI purpose ok this is the master uh, form for all other child forms so add a menu strip control from the toolbox and drag and drop on the menu form here you have one item in the menu that is new account okay uh, so after that so first of all open your menu property listen carefully open menu property not menu strip property actually this is the menu form property and true is an MDI container is true so this is looking like this so uh, in the new account menu strip add some items or you can say menu navigation items so first of all remove the new text from the root you can say uh, and the child is child uh, new child created that is new account in which you can add new customer also update and the search account and the third one is all customer here you can get all the customers okay so similarly um, in the second tab that is transactions and uh, a transaction can hold multiple lists that is deposit credit withdrawal something something like this uh, created new FDs also uh, is a part of the transaction uh, so in transfer FD form okay so in the third tab you can check the detail of the FDs so view is the navigation item of the menu strip is view and you can check the balance sheet and FDs so view FD and the last one is others uh, here you can log out your uh, log out from the, your system and exit also and also some other features of the uh, mm, to the admin that is change password option and last one is exit okay now click on the new account menu item double click on it similarly for the update so here you can uh, design the method stub actually for all the items of the menu looking like this similarly you can do for all such items of the navigation view FDs and the, in the other sections click logout change password and the last one is exit ok so now for the new account in the method stub what you can do you can call a new form inside the MDI form so first of all create a new form that is windows form and the name is new account okay this is the simple thing you can uh, do it here okay similarly uh, in the new account method stub of your menu item create a object of the form that is added 
already added in the solution explorer that is new account.cs file so create a object and set the mdi form of the for the uh, for this form so new account dot by using the object or you can say instance uh, name you can call the mdi parent property and mdi form is the menu item so call this assign the this and also open the form in the mdi form so first of all login in the by using the login and open the menu form when we click on the new account your new account form is opened in the same mdi form okay so the same thing you can do for the update form so add a new again add a new form or you can say add a new windows form for the update and the search account here so first of all add a new update and the search form that is windows form and give the name to the update and search form okay so similarly by using above uh, you can call update updation form up is the instance name and create an object for the update form updation form and set the mdi is menu that is this and open the form in the same window that is in the mdi form okay so you can do you can do for all the navigation items for the all customer deposit form withdrawal form so you can do by you similarly you can do for all the navigations okay so design it quickly i'm waiting for you because uh, without doing i will not show all the codes so please design it Uh, this is the third video tutorial of banking system here you can uh, learn how to design mdi form and uh, how to assign the new form to the mdi form and how to use the menu strip items in the mdi form and how to call uh, the new form in the mdi form by using the mdi form so these are the things you can learn in this video tutorial okay so design quickly i'm waiting for you for your uh, because you design well i know so do abc do karo okay so it's a thing similarly you can do for all the navigations and also subscribe my channel please 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 i request you subscribe my channel i'm waiting you please 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 subscribe my channel uh, i i'm sure i provide you better video tutorial of windows form and the c sharp gui features so please subscribe my channel i request you so here you can design all the thing is here like the uh, new account the code is this and the updation form the code is this so if uh, if you want to get error in any 
videos which is included in my uh, video uh, in my channel so please comment it if you got error and if you want to learn better so please 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 comment comment in uh, comment is net, uh, mandatory for me or you can say required uh, or you can say necessary things for me because without comment I never give you a better video tutorial okay so so please I hope you will comment you will do comment on my videos so for the logout and the exit navigation you can call this dot close this is the other thing so I explain you okay let's do open and check your code on your executable file with the executable file so username and the password first the page is login and op if successfully then open the new account in the same MDI form you can open multiple form in the same window that is MDI form so thank you very much please keep watching my all other videos if you like please subscribe share and like this video thank you very much